How's it going YouTube? Today I'm going to be showing you how to factory unlock your Apple iPhone 4S that is locked on the AT&T network using the website sellunlocker.net. So ultimately you're going to want to open up your favorite web browser and navigate to sellunlocker.net. You're going to reach this web page, scroll down, and it's pretty user friendly. It's asking what device you're wanting to unlock while well, I'm unlocking an iPhone today. So I'll select on that. It's going to redirect you to this web page. Scroll down till you reach step one. And right here, it's just selecting the information that's co that corresponds to you and your device, which we're going to be selecting an iPhone for us since that's what we're unlocking. That is locked to the AT&T network. And the last piece of information that's wanting is the IMEI number from the device. If you select on this box, a pop-up comes up and lets you know how to access the IMEI number from the device. So we're going to go ahead and do that right now. There's the IMEI number. We're going to input that into the corresponding box there. You want to make sure that you confirm the information, otherwise your phone will not be able to be unlocked if they don't have the correct IMEI number. So yes, I do see that it's correct. I'm going to go ahead and select look for code. And it redirected me to this web page telling me that the charge for unlocking this particular device would be $99.99, .99, which is a very, very, very decent price uh, considering. So we go ahead and go on to step two where they're basically just wanting basic contact information to go ahead and contact you once the unlock process is completed on their end. So we're going to go ahead and input this quick information here. And you really only need to input the required information. You might have a partner code. I do not. So I'm just going to go ahead and select place order. All right. Now it's just basically wanting you to review the information to make sure everything is correct so that there's no type of mix up with going ahead and unlocking this particular device. And I'm showing that everything is fine. Great. Okay. So you want to go ahead and read the terms and conditions. Once you've gone ahead and done that, you're going to go ahead and select I have read and accept the terms and conditions shown above. And you're going to go ahead and select unlock now. It's going to go ahead and redirect you to PayPal to go ahead and process your payment. So if you have a PayPal account, you can go ahead and basically log into your account and go ahead and process the payment like you normally would. If you do not have a PayPal account, you can go ahead and pay with your debit or credit card as a PayPal guest. Ultimately, once you go ahead and process your payment, you'll go ahead and receive a few emails letting you know that the order was received and that it's basically in the pending process. Uh, but what you're going to go ahead and be looking for is the final email. It's going to go ahead and let you know that the phone is unlocked. But you're still going to have some... Uh, steps that you have to go ahead and take care, uh, take care of on your end. So we can go ahead and see those steps right here. Uh, go ahead and read through those and ultimately I already have the latest uh, version of iTunes. My iPhone came pre-installed with iOS 5.1.1 so that's fine. I have all that. Um, but lastly it's wanting for me to go ahead and input the alternate network that I'm trying to go ahead and unlock to. So as you remember you can go ahead and see there that I have right now AT&T going ahead and showing up as the network on the iPhone 4S. Go ahead and zoom back out there. So now I'm going to go ahead and input the alternate SIM card. So I'm not sure how well you'll be able to see this, but I'm trying to focus in as best as possible here. It says Family Mobile, powered by T-Mobile. We're going to place this into the iPhone 4S. I'm going to go ahead and set that to the side. Now, 
we're going to go ahead and open up iTunes, which I pretty much already have done here. iTunes. And at this point, the instructions told us to go ahead and connect the device up. Let iTunes recognize the device. Sorry about that. And we'll go ahead and disconnect. So give it 10 seconds. And go ahead and reconnect. So now you get this message. Congratulations, your iPhone has been unlocked. To set, set up and sync this iPhone, click continue. So we're gonna go ahead and click continue. As you can see, I still have my iPhone 4S connected to my iTunes. Let's go ahead and bring the iPhone 4S into focus here. Showing the T-Mobile network. And just to prove to you that I have not switched phones on you, let's go ahead and check the IMEI. It's still the same one that we worked with in the very beginning. But the ultimate test is to make sure that I can make a phone call successfully on the T-Mobile network, which we're going to go ahead and try right now. Good evening. Short on time. Remember, our instant cash ATM service is open around the clock. Today's date is Wednesday. The call went through successfully. My iPhone 4S has now been factory unlocked. If you enjoyed the video, please go ahead and like it. I'd really appreciate it. And remember, if you want to go ahead and unlock your iPhone 4S, don't forget to visit sellunlocker.net. I really appreciate you guys' time. Have a wonderful day.